By the age of 50, more than half of men will be affected by male pattern baldness. Women aren't immune either, and that's why the hair restoration business has become a billion-dollar business. So far, there's no miracle cure, but treatments do seem to be getting better, and here's one of the newest. All right. It looks like something right out of Star Trek, the Synetics Advanced Laser Therapy System. I'm just going to position it over the scalp. 52-year-old Jeff Fowler's head is about to light up like a blast furnace. He doesn't mind. He just wants the hair on the back of his head to come back. I feel self-conscious about it. I feel like people, when they talk to me, their eyes wander up. So, does it hurt? Certainly no adverse effects from it. No heat or anything like that. But a little tingling is, is normal. You might remember the laser comb, a consumer sensation despite a four to $700 price tag and some drawbacks. Uh, I've had some patients complain that using the comb gets a little tedious for 20 minutes at a time. Your arm gets tired and so forth, so you tend not to do the 20 minutes. This new machine is about 10 times more powerful than the comb. The laser combs have either 5 to 10 small laser diodes where this in-house unit has 107. Before pictures on the left, after pictures on the right. However, not all doctors are convinced. People uh, have been trying to treat baldness for literally centuries and there have been thousands and thousands of devices and creams and lotions and potions that come out to treat hair loss and some of them don't work very well some of them end up being dangerous but for those who want to try to avoid hair transplant surgery the laser might be attractive the initial treatment costs around four thousand dollars after about a year booster sessions are recommended every three months the treatment's not yet available in the Seattle area, but a company spokesman told us he does expect it is coming here in the near future.